Hello everybody, how are you? I am Muhammad Ahmed and your teacher here and I will be teaching you different questions and their answers. So I welcome you on classtreater.com where we will be discussing question. A man who weighs ap approximately 140 pounds has two 12 ounce beads and one 1 by 2 all that shoots of liquid in one hour but is his estimated BAC. The correct answer of the question. Uh, the blood alcohol concentration into BAC is influenced by various factors including the patient's weight, the amount and type of alcohol consumed and the duration over which the alcohol is consumed while there are BAC calculators and formulas available. It's important to note that individual responses to alcohol can vary and these calculations provide estimates rather than precise values. Has a basic calculation using a simplified formula. BS, BS equal into alcohol consumed in grams body weight in grams multiply with, with mark fracture uh, multiply 100 BAC equal body weight in grams multiply with mark fracture alcohol consumed in grams multiply 100 assumptions. Assumptions: One ounce of alcohol is considered to be equivalent to 28 grams. The wine mark, the weed mark fracture for men is often taken as 0.68 given. Weight of the patient: 140 pounds into 1 pound for uh, equal 454 grams to 12 ounce beads to multiply 12 multiply 282 multiply 12 multiply 28 grams of alcohol 1 1 by 2 or that shoot liquor uh, 1.5 multiply 281.5 multiply 28 grams of alcohol calculate the total alcohol consumed in grams then calculate the BAC BAC in equal into Total alcohol consumed in grams body weight in grams multiply 0 0.68 uh, multiply 100 BAC equal into body weight in grams multiply 0 0.68 total alcohol consumed in grams multiply 100. Keep in mind that his uh, that this is a wrong estimate and actual BAC levels can be affected by various factors like metabolism health conditions and tolerance for a more accurate assessment it's advisable to use specialized BAC calculators or consult with the professionals additionally drinking responsibly and knowing the legal limits is crucial for one's safety so that's the correct answer of the question if you have any question just leave a comment i will be answering you as soon as i can thank you very much for watching the video Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe our channel. Until next question, bye bye.